What's going on guys, it's your boy Rombie since it's Tony here. Today we're here back again with another video, and today this is a Yu-Gi-Oh! related video, yay finally, and um, yes, uh, I'm going to be doing a deck profile on my Evil Storms, this is only a monster side, and it's actually double sleeve, that's why it looks really thick. Let's get it started with the deck profile of the monsters, alright, first of all we have the Rescue Rabbit, which is a really, really, one of my favorite cards. And I really want to use the evil, um, evil Swords on my OCG deck. And second off, we get the Maxi. Maxi is a really great card. I really love this guy. Uh, he's just really good because I it makes me draw a lot when I go against a lot of decks that I go special summons. And third, uh, third monster that I have to show you guys is the Heliopolis. And Heliopolis is really great because since you have uh, Evil Swords, uh, you can actually put this in there. And now because of the OCG has three um, uh, rabbits, they made a Dino Evil Swarms deck. This is a really great deck. The fourth monster I want to show you guys is the Casters. Casters is one of my one of my favorite monsters in the deck. He is just really good because he just saves you in the mirror matches because he can summon e e Excalibur. Should be the monster that you guys should be scared of when you're going against uh, uh, Evil Swarms because he is the beast. And then we have these three awesome, crazy cards. Mandagora, because this guy is great. A lot of people used only two, but I used three because of the uh, targets, you know, for the targets. So I want to get as many Evil Sword monsters on my hand so I can sum special summon and summon it. And also use it for Bahamut. And also we have the three Kirkian. Uh, Kirkian, Kirkian. I call it Kirkian, but... Or Kirkion, I usually say, but Kirkion, we have three Kirkion, but uh, we this card is really good when you have a lot of monsters in the Evil Sworn Graveyard. You should have this card because this guy's are really good when um, when it comes around the end. So the last monster that we want to show you guys is the two a uh, Thunderbird. I don't really don't I don't I don't really like this guy because this guy uh, just, I don't I personally don't like this guy, but I had to run two of them. Three Pandemics. I believe that you should have three because, you know, uh, people are really scared of this card, you know? This card is the major scary um, card in this deck, so I mean, I personally believe that this card should get the uh, three, you know what I'm saying? And also two, Dress, because I want to negate everyone. I don't want to negate everyone's effect, even the monster's effect, right here. So two Dresses. Very good card. We have two reinforced missile army. This card is a blast, dude. He just calls out casters. And next up, we have three, uh, two um, MST. MST is also a typical. I don't really explain that card, but he is a beast card. Next, we're Geki. Don't even really explain this guy. Uh, singles. Everyone sings. Book of Moon and Dark Hole. But anyways, we have inf uh, Infestation Infection. A very good card. He just, uh, he's pretty good when you have um, lack of monsters on your hand. And you have two monsters, but you don't have a caster or something, or Mendegora. And uh, you can use this guy to uh, trade it in. Trade it in, guys. Trade it in to a caster or Mendegora or Kirkian. He saved me a couple of my games before. I really appreciate this guy. He saved me in my deck. Because no one really targets this guy. Um, you know, he's like, oh, I set this guy. And uh, they were like, oh, psh. This guy's nothing, and so they underestimate this card too much. And this guy is really good because you pretend you have, uh, they have a lot of monsters. They have pretend they have two monsters. You have a Thunderbird and a uh, Heliopolis, and uh, in your hand, you can actually trade in your Heliopolis. So you don't you want to use your uh, when when you draw a rabbit, you don't want to use uh, all two of them, uh, all of them. And you can trade in your Heliopolis for the Kirkian uh, or the Caster, and you can summon Caster and normal summon the Thunderbird, and basically you can seize or attack the opponent. So that's pretty good. That's a really good card. This card is the Beast card. Also, uh, Vanity's Emptiness, a uh, very good card. Don't really explain this card because everyone plays this card. Torrential Tribute and Balmas Trap Hall. And the next up is two uh, Mirror Force. Very good card. Everyone is like, I'm like. Surprise! And so, Fiendish Chain, very good card again. I have two of those, very nice. Also, Dimensional Prison, um, it's just a fill-in, fill but very good card too. 
But for the extra deck, I have loads of extra decks. I love my extra deck right now. Pretty good extra deck, I believe in myself. But we got two, not only two, but three Evil Storm Opion. Very good card. Very good card. Everyone fears of this card. Two vomits. This is why you need a lot of evil storm targets because this guy, when you have, you can just steal. It, he's like a Mr. Steal your girl if you discard one evil storm. So this guy it just is beast. Also, this evil storm uh, Exiton Knight, very good card. You know, he just explodes everything. Uh, Bahamut and um, this guy, I don't really use him, but he's pretty good. He's just really good in some decks. And so I'm using it. This guy really works well with Ophion. Very good card. And uh, 101, very good card. I really love this guy. I really want to use two um, 101s because he's a freaking amazing guy. And a uh, Dark Rebellion XYZ Dragon. Very good card. I really love this guy. I usually use this guy every single time. So this guy is a beast. It's also a secret rare, so I'm pretty happy about that. Also, Exiton Knight, Ex oh, sorry, Excalibur, guys. Excalibur is another amazing card, guys. This guy wins mirror matches. When you're going against a lot of uh, Evil Swarm, you have a you're going to stall time the most of the time. And also, this guy, when you summon Excalibur, this guy can destroy your Ophion. So, this guy is a really amazing card. Also, uh, Sky Blaster, very good card. Uh, Cowboy, another amazing card. Dweller, great card again, and uh, only on some decks. And also number 50, very great card. This guy is just really crazy because this guy is just gonna be, not only gonna destroy your monsters, less than 2,100, but he will destroy you and uh, make, you use, and make you lose 1,000 life points. And that's really, Crazy good. Okay, thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy this video, please slam down the like button. If you guys want to see more Yu-Gi-Oh contents like your deck profile, pack openings, mostly pack openings, and also um, a Minecraft videos, please subscribe to my channel. That would be appreciated. And um, also, if you guys want to like this, if you guys like this deck, please slam down the like button. That would be really another amazing supportive uh, to my channel. It's great, guys. That would be great. And oh yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, like this video. If you guys have anything suggestions in this deck i'll be greatly appreciated in the comments down below if you guys write that down greatly appreciated thank you guys for tuning into this video and uh yeah i'll see you guys later peace